How do you insert a table into Gmail? When you're composing a new message, there's no feature down here or tool that allows you to create a table, but you're easily able to insert them. We could just copy them over from another program like Google Docs or Google Sheets, which you could sign in with your Gmail account. So if we were in Google Docs, then we can simply insert a table into Google Docs, or if you have one already created, that's just as easy. And you can make that table whatever you want here. So I'm gonna make a little three by two table. I can put information in here. Uh, you know, it doesn't really matter. All I have to do is copy the table, right? And then over here, I'm gonna put in maybe just some numbers, 840. And so you can style this however you want, right? Use all your options in here to adjust the, the border width if you want, you know, make the borders a lot bolder, change the font, but you can't actually do some of that in Gmail as well. Now, as far as, you know, the sizing of the table and the columns and stuff, that here you need to do in Docs. But when it comes to the text, you can still edit that in Gmail. So we're going to highlight the table and we can press Command or Control C or come up here to edit and copy this table. So we're basically going to copy paste it into our email. So make yourself some space. I put a couple enters into here and then I've got uh, a spot here where I can just paste it. Command V or Control V. And so that pasted in the table. Now I can still come in here and add data if I want to. I can highlight everything and make sure, you know, I get the font just the way that I want it, make sure all the sizing is the same. And so I can still come in and make some tweaks to it, but that's how you can quickly bring in a table. Now you can also do this with Google Sheets. So I'm gonna delete this, hit return again to give myself some space, and go to Google Sheets. So if I have a table like this created, I could highlight all these cells, almost said shells, uh, by holding shift, and clicking from one corner to the other. So I've got everything highlighted. Now I can do the same thing, Command or Control C, or go to Edit, Copy, come over here to my email, and paste it in here. I could even right click and say Paste. And that pastes that chart, or well, not a chart, but that table into Gmail. Now, if you used fonts that maybe Gmail doesn't have correctly, it might change the fonts. But yeah, you can still highlight everything and have it be whatever font you want. I could click this sans serif. I could reduce the text size a little bit and edit whatever I want here. You know, make things bold, etc. Now I can't obviously change the table size or the cell size or anything, but we can still change the data. And so that's pretty easy to insert a table here in Gmail.